What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Evolution Ever, and where, as you can see, by all of these auto-claimed rewards of packs and trophies and Future Stars cards, the season has ended. The new season is here. We're about to take a look at what is out. And if I jump over to this, which I've just quickly recorded as we load into Ultimate Team, Foot Birthday is coming, or Ultimate Birthday, as they're calling it. Even though you can literally see underneath, it says Football Ultimate Team. Just call it Foot Birthday EA. That's what we all know it as. Come on. It's Foot Birthday. Five star, five star, five star, five star. For what looks like, Hullet on the right and Messi on the left. And the most exciting part of this, for me, is leakers are finished. I have absolutely no idea what is coming out for Foot Birthday. Sheriff, the usual guy who leaks stuff, tweeted Messi and Hullet out after the loading screen come out. Come on, bro. You even got the stats wrong. Sheriff's finished in the mud, and we absolutely love it. The hype is coming back to 6 p.m., which is so good. I really hope EA keep a lid on this and bring the 6 p.m. hype back. It's so much better when everything isn't leaked. It's Friday now when I'm recording this. We're going to be designing a new team, trying some new custom tactics, and trying to have some fun in foot champs. And I'll come back at 6 o'clock to round this video off with the foot birthday content and reaction to that as well. And we've got the reaction to the new season because I wasn't on yesterday and I haven't really had to look at it. So let's have a little flick through. I did see a couple of things on social media. One of them that you get to choose between a five-star weak foot or five-star skill moves in Sinier, which is exciting. So... Let's have a flick through. So we've got FC Pro Stadium themes and stuff. That, do you know what? To be fair, that TIFO actually looks quite nice. 82 times 2. Coin boost. Okay. Packs. Stadium theme. 84 times 2 again. Oh, an eSports TIFO. I mean, that's cool. It does make me want to flick through and see whether all of them are there. But first up, we've got a double play style plus Hector Bellerin with five star weak foot. So it seems like the theme they are leaning on for foot birthday is five star something. Love the Tash Hector, love the Whip Pass Plus, love the Quick Step. Big fan of the stats as well, to be fair to him. He looks really, really good. Okay, what else we got? More packs, another eSports TIFO, another eSports TIFO, brown gold players pack, and a choice between 85 times 2 or 84 times 3. Ooh! Hullet Gang, 5-star skill moves, Intercept plus and Relentless plus. Oh my god, has he got enough playstyles? Like, hang on, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten playstyles with two of them plus. Bloody hell. What else you got? More TIFOs, more pen, 83 times 10, nice. And 83 times 20. More TIFOs, more TIFOs. 85, 85. There's the Insigne pick where you get to pick between technical, rapid, five star skills. Okay, technical, rapid, five star, you can the exact same card. Just one's got five-star skills, one's got five-star weak foot. That's interesting. I like that. I like the variance. I like the little bit of choice, different paths you can go down. An 84 times 10, an ultimate birthday single player pack. An 85 times 10, bloody hell. Fodder is crazy. Jota for his eSports team, that is funny. And then a player pick for a Centurion, Ultimate Dynasties, Thunderstruck, Winter Wildcards, or Team for the Year icon. Nice. Uh, do you know what? That seems like a good season. They've got the players back, which I really, really like. And apparently, in the objectives, which, as you guys can see, I've got lots to claim, and I need to make sure I do my daily logins. Make sure you guys do your daily logins. we got foot champs back to give us more red picks. EA? Yes. Okay, win 35. And for a pro one, win 75. So this is a... F is this a four-week or a five-week job? It's got to be a five-week one, because if it's a four-week one, you've got to go in 19 every week. Okay, yeah, so it must be for five weeks. So you need 15 wins each week. Okay, that's not too bad. Apparently, where is it? There's an objective. Is it in milestones? Is it in season? There it is. You've got to use the Western McKenney and the Insigne and the Bellerin in order to do these objectives throughout the season and you unlock this Kola Mawani which is absolutely mental aerial plus power shot plus one two three four five six seven eight again ten play styles and crazy stats with five star weak foot that's pretty mad to be fair so that's looking pretty jazzy we've got a lot of packs saved up as well for foot birthday so I guess we might open them today at 6pm 
Although my chat might kill me if I just jump on for 10 minutes to do a content reaction and don't live stream <laughs> me opening my 84 times 20 and stuff. I'll see, I'll see how I'm feeling. But what we're gonna do in this video is make a new team. This is what we've been rocking with. So I was on a red card, actually, so we need to sort that out. But I just want to try something a bit different. There's going to be a lot of similar players, and we're going to use quite a few of them again, especially my red ones. I want to use Red Bramfleet. I want to use Kanji. We may be going to put him in the showdown upgrade. But just try out some new formations. Try out some new tactics. Try out some new players. We've got 1.4 mil to spend, almost 1.5. I'm going to go away. I'm going to discuss with the Twitch chat. If you want to come watch it live, twitch.tv slash AJ3. Link is down in the description. And I'll come back to you guys once I've got a new team and some new custom tactics and stuff to play within Foot Champs. And I'll show you guys. And then we'll jump into some games. Welcome back. We have been grinding. Don't worry. We've saved the biggest pack still for Foot Birthday. That comes out now in just over four hours. It's been a little while. We've been grinding for quite a bit. And we've designed ourselves and done some SBCs to get a really good team. I'm excited to try this out with you guys. So, one of the ways I've been grinding is with these 80 plus player picks. Can we get one last little bit of fodder? No, that's okay. We've managed to do... I'm going to take you guys over to the... Oh, we're already there! We've managed to do Rolfo. Who is basically guaranteed all four upgrades, to be honest with you, because Barcelona women's are the best women's team in the world. Sorry, Chelsea, Leon, Wolfsburg fans, Arsenal fans. It's, it's Barcelona. She got Ping Pass Plus, she got Trickster Plus, which is a bit weird because she only has four star skills. But everyone has been telling me this card is unbelievable and it's going to get upgraded even more. Unfortunately, she didn't get the clean sheet upgrade. They won 6 1. And somehow conceded 1 in like the 85th minute in their last game. But the wins are good, the goals are good. She's going to make some appearances because she's back. We're looking spicy. We're looking very nice. She's going to be really, really good. We've got one squad left to do. We've done all of these basically with just complete untradeable stuff from our club. The odd may be like 85 or 86 chucked in. This one has actually started to get a little bit tradable. So we've got untradable Courtois and Lewandowski. Untradable St. Max and Joe Linton. And the 84s are untradable. But the 86s and this 88 are tradable. I think Mill no, Millie Bright is untradable. So we've actually ended up having to spend a little bit of coins to finish off this SBC because the club is absolutely, well and truly, completely muddered now. It is gone. Finished. We've done a Kanji. We've done a Rolfo. Have we done any of our SBCs recently? I'm not sure, but we're going to start working on David Ginola. We've still got like two months to do it, so we're not stressing, but we need to start focusing our fodder towards that. Fridolina is here. She gets a club link and a league link, obviously, because it's the same club, to Queen Claudia. All she needs, really, is a dynamic image EA. Now that she's back playing, sort it out for us. Make this card look even better. And let's jump over and let me show you guys the team that we've put together. You can see we've got 579k. So we've spent some coins on it to try out some new players. And if I jump over to the squad and just do the dramatic reel instantly, rather than going through a squad builder, this is it. Obviously, with a hole left for Fridolina to go into. So we shall do that. In she goes. Let me just try and fix these dynamic images so it actually looks quite nice, shall we? There we go. We have got ourselves Player of the Month Hoyland, Future Stars David Beckham, Fantasy Rolfo, Fantasy FC, Fantasy Foot, Fantasy FC Pedro Porro to give this guy a go because everyone's gassing him up to ridiculous levels. And he's like 44k. And everyone's saying he's better than Cafu, so we're going to give him a go. Queen Claudia is staying, of course. Werner's been upgraded, we want to give that a go. Kimmich has just had a boost to Ping Pass Plus, so we've now got two Ping Pass Plus centre mids in Kimmich and Rolfo. I might do the Akanji Evo, I might start that off. And then Van der Sar's back just for chemistry, annoyingly. To be honest with you, all goalies stink, so it doesn't really matter that much. Maybe if we sell some of our fodder, if it goes up a foot birthday, we'll by Team of the Year check or something like that. But for now, that is the squad. The bench is outrageous. Eusebio's on the bench. Zidane's on the bench. Vieira's on the bench. Basher is. Sauer will be once a red card disappears. Other options to bring in oh, that we were looking at. Harrison, Trent, Grealish. We've got Dobbin on the bench as well to flex our red Everton card. It's looking good. I'm excited to try this team out. What we're going to be playing in-game is... Primarily for triple two. And I've honestly completely just made these custom tactics up myself. 
So they could be horrendous or they could be great. I was having a little nose around at people's custom tactics and they keep saying things like, be really compact in defense. I, I, I just want to try and score, to be honest with you. So I've got both of my fullbacks on balance to get forward. And I've put both my CDMs on cover wing. We've then got our right and left cam, drift wide, get into the box and, and come back. You know, we don't want to actually have an absolute terrible time. We want one of these to come back and do some defending, but we don't want the whole 4-2-3-1. Four defenders, two CDMs, two wide cams and a central cam all parked on the box. That's boring. We've got these guys to get forward. Oh, stay central, sorry. One getting behind. Hoyland to be the target man. Beckham to whip the balls in. Pedro Porro to whip them in. Davies to whip them in. Claudio with the finesses. Werner with the pace. These with the ping passes. Basically, we're looking for the four centre ones, Bramfway to Kanji, Rolfo, Kimmich, and then everyone else just sort of pivoting around them in a circle. That's the logic I've gone for in my head, which is why I've got my... Fullbacks getting forward and my cams coming back and people overlapping and Werner getting in behind, but Hoyland not. Maybe I'm a lunatic. Maybe I'm a genius. I don't know. <laughs> but we shall see. I've just completely made it up. I'll be honest with you. This could go absolutely terribly. We've also got a 4-2-3-1, which I again just made up myself because I didn't want both fullbacks on stay back and both CDMs on stay back and these on come back and just all everyone on come back. So but we've again gone for the same thing. I'm going to change Beckham to this one because Pedro Parra is staying back. We're going to attack down the left. Davies and Werner can interchange. Rolfo's on cover wing to cover for Davies and she's a deep line playmaker. Kimmich is just on stay back cover centre. Claudia is staying on the edge of the box. Hoyland staying central. I'm going to go mental. I've not got literally everyone on get forward, but we don't want the Great Wall of China in front of our defence. And then we do have an emergency 4-3-2-1, just in case we need to switch to it because we're getting absolutely battered. But that was just a very quick overview of the randomness that I've made up. All we need to do is get an engine on... I'm not going to call a Queen Rolfo because we've still got Claudia in the team, but she can have an engine for now. We'll see how good she is. Let's get into a game and try this out. All right, let's see who we're playing against. First game. Casillas, Maldini, Colas Berto. Got Rolfo as well. Got Kimmich. Yours isn't red though, mate. Werner, Mbappe, Jorginho, Salah. Very, very, very good team. Oh, he's got a great chip through ball. Ah, okay. Do you know what? That's a nice goal. He's worked it well. We threw the ball away a little bit silly from a throw-in, and then he's... Done well to chip it through. This guy seems like a really good player. And we're not getting absolutely battered, which is good. So, fingers crossed that this is going to work quite well. This guy is loving, loving the boost to ping pass. Oh my god. Yeah, this guy's really good. Really, really good, actually. Really, that's a nice goal again. This guy's really, really good. We've been unlucky not to score a couple of times. This guy's crazy. Fair play. Okay. This is one of them games where I am much happier losing to this guy than I am hammering away at somebody playing Park the Bus 5 back or Park the Bus 4 2 3 1 or something like that. This guy's really good. His dribbling's really, really nice. We've been a bit unlucky not to score a couple of times from headers and also just last-ditch tackles when we're about to get shots away. So, can't knock it, to be honest with you. This guy's really, really good. We're still getting used to the team. Still having to second-guess myself about who, which player's who because I'm not as used to them and their different boot colours and haircuts and stuff like that. But we'll get there. It's feeling all right. Okay, we've got a goal back. Was that a finish by Hoyland? It was a nice little ball around the corner. It was. Bit of a jammy finish, to be honest with you. Didn't really deserve to go in that one. We've just been absolutely cheesed, to be honest with you. I thought the comeback was on, and we've just been cheesed into oblivion. This guy's attacking play is really good. His defending isn't as good as maybe I'm giving him credit for. It's a little bit reckless, and he's just kind of got away with it a couple of times. But his attack and play is really, really nice, and he's very clinical when he gets the opportunity, even if the opportunity does come from a little bit of cheese, like it did then.
That was a power shot. I wonder if that actually... Let's have, We're going to have a look at that. Because I was definitely pressing both buttons then for a power shot. Either way, the team feels right, you know. It's definitely novel, and it's definitely different to play in 4 3 2 one Go on, Jared Brown. Okay. <laughs> Wait, is he giving me a pen? No, it's the end of the game. Yeah. It was perhaps a little bit flattering on the scoreline, but that guy was really good. And we're rocking new players and a new formation and stuff, so... Can't really moan about losing, to be honest with you. Like I said, better to lose to someone like that and have a bit of fun trying some new players out and to someone who actually is good at dribbling and stuff. Reasonably happy. Let's play another game. All right, game number two is against Icon FC and Vlahovic and Stein. <laughs> nice. Go on the four, triple two. That is such a... I mean, it's a really good finish from Hoyland, but it's such a terrible goal. I went for a deep cross with Beckham, and it bounced off someone's head and landed perfectly at Hoyland's feet. That's not okay, really. We've done well to green time it, and he's absolutely hammered it into the top bins, but not ideal, that. All right, Hoyland! Bloody hell, mate! <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay. <laughs> this guy is crazy. <laughs> I was expecting a header and just went for it just because cross FC. This card's good. It's only one squad as well. All right, Patches has been out for a while now, mate. We've sat the goalie down with a cancelled power shot plus. Go on, Andy. Nah, this Hoyland is ridiculous. Oh my god! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> the Hoyland is wild! I quite like having two strikers up front. Like, two proper actual striker strikers, rather than two strikers and a uh, striker and two centre forwards. Oh my god. That Hoyland is just absolutely cooked. That is crazy. Well, this Hoyland seems quite good. Three goals and an assist in his first two games. I like it. Vayne is doing well. Claudius perhaps a little wasted as a wide camp because we haven't got into any good finesse opportunities with her. But well, she's doing right. She gets some chem for Rolfo. Beckham seems quite nice. I'm enjoying using him. I'm going to go play some more foot jumps on the stream. I'll come back to you guys at 6 o'clock today with a content drop, basically, for foot birthday, which is very, very exciting. Still no leaks, which is fun. So we'll come back with our live reaction of that. And then I guess you guys are probably watching this Saturday morning, maybe Saturday afternoon. This is fun. I'm enjoying the road to glory again. I'll see you guys at six o'clock. To me, anyway, I'll see you guys in the video in like after this cut. Welcome back then. It's gone very well. We are seven and one. And might I just say, Play of the Month Hoyland is absolutely cracked. Eight goal contributions in eight games in a two-man strike partnership. Beckham's good. Pedro Porro's getting some assists from right back. Queen Claudia's Queen Claudia. This Rolfo is insane, and I scored maybe the coldest goal in foot champs I've ever scored ever. I'll show you guys that in a bit, because what we're here for is foot birthday. I didn't get the loading screen when we loaded in, so we're going to take a look in concepts. Let's see what we've got. Two Benzema's, Aerial and Finesse. Jesus Christ. That one's got five-star skills, that one's got five-star weak foot, otherwise they are identical. I'm getting twin cards again. There's twin Saka, again, five-star, five-star, alternate versions. He looks crazy with Tiki Taka Plus. One De Bruyne, one Sun, one Komen, one Morgan, one Araujo. There's the Insignes, Beth Mead, that's a cool one. Nothing immediately jumping out to me as Everton or Everton past and present, but there is a five-star, five-star Messi with technical plus and finesse plus. <laughs> That's going to cost so many coins. EAR mental. What else we got? Not really seeing any Everton stuff. Felipe Anderson, Flair's kind of dead though. Gosens looks all right. He's got the double version. There's a Kimpembe, there's a Falcao, and there's a Stash. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Which one's he got? Oh my god, he's got both. Wait, so the ones that don't have duo cards have both. Is that true for all of them? Five star, five star Morgan? Yes. Five star, five star De Bruyne? Yes. Oh my god, let's have a look at the icons. And then we need to go and look at the Evos, because that's what I'm most excited about. Hullet! Oh my god. <laughs> Henri. Oh, okay. So Hullet's five star, five star. But Henri is pick one. Interesting. Carlos Alberto. 
Jesus, them play styles. Berg Camp, Socrates, five star, five star Socrates. I love Socrates historically on Ultimate Team. There's a foot birthday Vandasaur that's got five star skill moves. Sure, I mean, my Vandasaur is completely useless, and you might have noticed I've got a bought Team of the Year check for 700k because it was just sitting there, and Vandasaur was pissing me off, to be honest with you. So, we won't, but hopefully, we don't pack this Vandasaur because I don't really want him. Van Nistelrooy doesn't have alternates, so he's five star, five star. Blanc has the alternates, closer doesn't. So, that's a f oh, hang on, Wait, there's a five star skills closer. Where's the other one? EA, is my theory wrong? Why is he five star, four star? I don't know, he's got Aerial Plus though, which is kind of mad. Nice! This looks very jazzy. Very expensive, especially when you're in the Icon section. Let's go and see what Evos they've got, because this is what we're here for, isn't it, really? This is what I want. We want to be able to get our James Garner upgraded to 5-star, five 5-star. Five we want to be able to get him Relentless Plus or Incisive Pass Plus or Pig, something like that. Come on. So, this we just as a kind of move. We don't care about these. Down the right, we've got a week to decide if you want to put, pay 100k for Patterson. Golden Glow Up. There's not really a very good Everton player to put this on. In fact, there's barely even an Everton player to put this on because I've got Evos of the, good, the decent silvers like Garner, Patterson, and Bramthwaite already. Icons and icons stink. This is the moment of truth. Come on, EA. Ooh. Why is it still overall 85? First of all, all right, but it's not position... Oh, no, it's not position restricted. We've just been a pain in the ass. Why? Why are we max 85? What can go into this for me? Ellis Sims... I got him in a player pick before. He's Everton past and present. Really? It's 100k. Wait, what are you giving us? Two pace, two shooting, two passing, two dribbling, two physical. One shooting, one passing, one first touch plus. Five star weak foot, four star skills, and more stats. It's actually quite good. That, that card actually looks quite good, to be fair. Wait, hang on. Why... Why does that say five stars? Wait, 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 wait. That says, oh my God, it's plus four star skill moves. Not two four star skill moves, plus four star skill moves. Oh my God, so you get a five star, five star Ellis Sims. You have my attention, EA. Oh my God, we're gonna need to find and have a look and see if there's a, we can do it twice. My interest is peaked. Okay. You have my attention. Is there going to be some mad Evo combos? I, I, oh, oh, you're allowed to put an in-progress one in. Oh, what's going on there then? All right, we're going to have to have a look for some good combos. Maybe we can get a little McNeil chain on the go. Or I, I don't know. We'll, we'll have to see. We'll have to see. But that's pretty cool. What else have we got? Because there's more down here. That's the showdown. We still need to do that on a kanji. Weak foot peak. Max 85, still, it is more GA. Can we have max 86, please, so I can put James Garner in one? Pace 85, defend an 89. Def in the midnight. Oh my God, Bramfweight is so close. Oh my God, don't tell me if, oh no. Oh wait, you, hang on, he already has, what, what are we getting? One, one, two, two, five star weak foot, jockey plus, okay. I almost had a heart attack because it seems like they've brought Evo Chains back and I just claimed Bramthwaite to tip him up. <laughs> oh, wait, no, no, no. He would have been too high rated. It's okay. It's okay. Don't stress, Andy. But it's also given Jockey Plus anyway, so he's already got that. And is that it? Okay. So that is an Evo that seems to be for a midfielder is what I'm going to guess at based on the example they've given here and the fact that it's sort of an all-round Card, not too crazy defender, not too crazy pace. Someone who's a centre mid, they've just been a pain in my ass and made it max 85. I mean, I can put Holgate in it and it's free and he played for Everton, so I may as well. And this Conor Gallagher is eligible for it, so that could be, he's tradable, so we could sell him, make some coins. So that looks all right, actually. Why? Please, EA, please, for the love of God, please just let me put my Everton players into Evos. Look at him, he fits every stat. In fact, he's ridiculously under the stats. He's got six less pace. He's got six less defending. He's got one less physical. He does, he's got one play star plus, but he's 80. He's one right in too much. Come on, man. I want a five star week for James Garner. Anyway. We can maybe put Onana in it as well and get Onana five star week foot. And he looks, that looks cool actually because he's pink. 
but he does have 56 balance. <laughs> okay. Evo's not looking too terrible. Not looking like I'm absolutely buzzing because I get to finally upgrade the Everton cards that I made in October. But pretty good. Pretty good. Okay. Sure. I'm, I, I'm trying to be... Oh! Oh! Interesting. That's pretty good. Inform Tarkovsky, dynamic image pink card. All right, that's not too bad. I'm trying to be objective. I'm trying not to just be too negative because I'm gassed for foot birthday because I do love this promo. I am a little scared as to how expensive some of the cards are going to be. And, ooh, could we, do, could we chain them? Maybe. The right wing, the right back one, and then that one. That could make a good Patterson. So I, this is my initial just straight in. Here's the content. And we're going to go and open some packs now as well because I've got these 84 times 20s and stuff saved up. In order for me to give a proper objective opinion on the Evos, I need to go and look at FootGG. I need to play around with some chains, see what's good for Everton, see what isn't, etc., etc. But yes, I'm just clicking there and be like, oh, what have we got? So let's open an ultimate pack that's tradable. Why not? I'm not optimistic of getting anything. That is a Morris, which is fodder. And then I'm going to open the 84 times 20. Oh, hello, Griezmann. That is good fodder. Very good fodder. In you go to the club. You guys can get discarded. I'm not optimistic of packing a foot birthday. And my stream's probably going to kill me for opening this off camera for you guys. But we're going to do it. We're going to send it. Why not? A little bit of bonus content for the video watchers and the stream viewers will have to come across and see. Okay, so there's some more fodder. That's nice. That's Donnarumma. My club is absolutely finished as well, by the way. Like, completely in the mud. So, so gone from doing Rolfo and doing a kanji and all of that sort of stuff. We have got these packs to start building it back up. There's an 85 times 7, and I'm just going to send it. Come on, EA. Show. Oh, special flair. Special flair. Spanish. Center back. Barcelona. Oh, it's Paredes. It's double. Oh, my God. This could be anyone. <gasps> Who is it? Ooh, Milinkovic Savic. 89 rated. Intercept and press proven. In the Saudi League, but in the Hullet Gang. Five-star skills or five-star weak foot EA? Both! Woohoo! Hello! Okay. That's very jazzy. That is a lot of playstyles. Oh, three, six, seven, eight, nine, two of them plus. Five-star, five-star, six foot four, high, high wear crates. Oh my god. He looks mental. And we got an inform as well to do an 83 times 10. Class. Let me know then your initial impressions of foot birthday. What are you feeling? What are you thinking? Do you reckon it's going to be good? In fact, I was going to just send it now and open the 84 times 20. I'm going to open these tradable ones as well. Let's just see. Let's just tempt fate. But let me know what you think. So far, it seems pretty decent. I am, as with all the promos, hesitant to think I'm going to be able to get many of the cards, especially the good ones, because they're going to be stupidly priced. But... It's looking good. They've updated Div Rival Rewards as well, which is cool. So it's actually more beneficial to try and climb the divisions. I'm enjoying Foot Champs playing the 4 triple 2 I'm excited for the Evos. I wish, please, can we make them 86 instead of 85? It's been 85 since the start of the game. But optimistic. EA seem to have solved the leaking problem, which makes it so much more hype as well. And there's lots of SPCs and stuff. And we haven't even taken a look at objectives. We haven't even looked at the SPCs, actually. Hang on. Let me see what we got here. Campaign. Yes, yes. They were there. They were there. That was terrible. Bloody, bloody, blah, bloody, bloody, blah. Oh. Oh, so that's... Okay, so that's the Komen that we've seen before. Five-star, five-star Komen. Ping pass and rapid. He looks very good. What are we saying? 84, 86, 88, 87, 88, 89. Bloody hell. That's like 700k, I think. Christ. All right. <laughs> what else we got? We got a spring update promotion player moments. So you can pick a player from one of the promoted clubs. All right. Got time for that. Given clubs that don't usually get special cards, special cards. These are the dupe exchanges. And I think that's it for now. So then if we go over to objectives before we open this 84 times 20, I am teasing you guys. I can only apologize. What's auto claim? Some kits. We don't care. Show me the good stuff. What's in live? Daily login. Need to do that. Nothing yet. Oh, no, that's Falcao. Oh, he's an objective. Ooh, interesting. Five-star weak foot. Finesse plus power header. No aerial. Bit weird for Falcao, but that's okay. And then nothing there. Seasonal is Kolo Mawani. All right. It's looking promising. It's looking very promising. I'm absolutely terrified to check the price of Messi and Morgan and stuff like that. So I'm just not even going to. 
I'm just going to come in and open the 84 times 20 and say, let me know what you guys think of Foot Birthday down in the comment section. And we're hopefully going to leave the video on an absolute bang. This could be dangling, though. This is going to be dangling, isn't it? It's untradeable. French striker. Imagine we just packed in Bappe. That would be mental. But we've not. We've got Griezmann. It's a double walkout. And we've hopefully got some special cards dangling behind. Even if it's just in forms, so we can do more 83 times 10s and stuff. There's Endler. Okay. This is the moment of truth. This is a skip. And then we've got to scroll along, I think, to see if there's anything special there. Okay. Two in forms for Tongan and Stock. Very nice. And another Ella Sims. Okay. The 85 times 7 delivered. The 84 times 20 did not. But we've got some informs and fodder and stuff. And we've got a cool Evo that we can maybe do on Sims. I'll see you guys in the next episode.